Hello Leo, welcome to Reading Journey. I'm Julie Journey and I'm doing a reading for the sun, moon, rising sign of Leo. Leo, here's where you will find your readings every Friday. And if you want more detailed readings, you can click the link in the, in the description box below that will take you to Patreon. Let's get into it, my love. Let's see. The sun, is that not Leo? Okay, let me take a look here, Leo. We've got stubbornness. We've got a trap, and then these two fell out together, and I'm going to take them as such. This one was clarifying this one. All right, so let's take a look here. Give me one moment, my love. All right, so the overall energy here for you, Leo, and by the way, we're using Panther Oracle, and we're using the Rose Oracle. Um, the overall energy is enjoyment for you. So this is a good time for you to actually enjoy some things, okay? Um, but you have to look at the bright side as well as so what I'm getting. Um, there's something that... Give me one second here. There's something that... There might be some advice that comes through. That may be worthy advice, okay? Something that's going to help you. It also will answer an answer that you have at this time, okay? You've been trying to get the answer, but I'm hearing it's not coming through the right people. You think it needs to come through a certain person or it needs to come by a certain route or certain way. Pay attention to what is coming your path because it looks like the divine, God, source, universe, he, she, whatever you believe in, is answering the question for you. Um, and it's, this is the answer you need, but it's coming through a different source. You know, for all you know, it could come through a homeless person, right? Um, it could, could, you know, it could come through a bum. It could come through anyone. It's, it's, it's an answer that's going to come a way that you least suspect it. It could come off of a billboard. Who knows? It could come off of a child just passing by you walking in and say, da 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 and just walk. It could be that. So the universe is trying to teach you how to be open and how to trust them to know that there is no one way that they do things. That it can happen any way. Okay? So be aware of this because if not, you'll get caught up in a trap. Because what the negative energy is trying to do is trying to give you the idea that it's coming through a different route and it's not. We have to, when we want answers from the universe, God, source, whatever you believe in, they're not going to be the traditional way we expect. Okay. Um, also be aware that just because it's glitter, everything that glitters is not gold, right? Is the saying so just because something looks good this is a this is going a different route okay this is a second read it's going a different route just because something looks really good it's really shiny it's beautiful it's pretty it's bright doesn't mean it's the right thing for you somebody is also looking at maybe a potential partner but you're looking at all the surface things okay um they're asking me to just let you know that everything that glitters, again, is not gold. We have to look beyond the surface. We have to look more within than on the out. Because that's how we get, again, caught in traps when we are just looking at the surface and not the inner. Because even the devil, the Bible talks about how the devil is a wolf in sheep's clothing right? People that want to do something to you, especially, especially narcissists, psychopaths, and sociopaths, they always come off so sweet, don't they? They come off so nice, so sweet. Oh, and then they gotcha, you know? And they just keep dangling the little carrot and, oh, you can't have this carrot. Oh, you want this carrot? Oh, you can't have this carrot. You, this carrot? No, not this carrot. That's how they do, right? They give you a little bit of something and take it away. All right, now, going back to the first ring that I start started at, bear with me here. And I apologize for these sniffles. This time, it's not even allergies. This time, I caught some cooties. Yeah, I said cooties. Okay. So, I definitely... Ooh, hold up. Let's back up. So, both groups I just talked to. Group one, you... Um, 
the ones that are having like the uh you're not really listening you expect it to come a certain way both groups here you've been having some type of dreams about the situation you had a dream about the situation or a nightmare i should say um pay attention to it okay pay attention to your dreams they're trying to get something across to you especially those of you the glitter gold thing this person is wearing a mask they're a Jekyll and a Hyde. Somebody here is dealing with a sociopath or psychopath, whether it's in work, whether it's love, whether it's family, whatever it is. I'm hearing up to tricks. Somebody's up to tricks, so evaluate it. Just be aware. No need to be scared or on edge and like, oh, somebody trying to trick me. No, just simply pray. Ask the God source, whatever you believe in, will show you who this person is and you go on about your day. And it will be clear to you. There's no need to dwell on it. There's no need to be like, oh, who could it be this week? No, don't do that to yourself. Because that also is a trap. Okay? I apologize. I'm going to get some water in my throat. It's getting dry quicker than usual. All right. So, just be aware of that. Just listen to what people say. See their actions. How do they, what is the fruit? What are they producing? What have they produced? If they're trying, someone's trying to sell somebody or get somebody on board with them on something, look at what they've done. What's their past history? Do you have anything to show me? You know, like if anybody's trying to sell you something or give you, say, okay, well, show me some past clients or show me some past things that you have done and make sure it's more than like one or two things and show you some quality stuff. You know, show me what you have. Let me see if this is something. And do your research, too. Somebody's also going to hire a contractor. That, car that con contractor's not legit. He's not legit. I don't care. Somebody referred him to you, too. Somebody, I mean, keep hearing your friend. So if it was a friend, a relative, anybody referred you, this person, mm -mm. see their licenses. Like, where's your licenses? Do you have license and insurance? It please see that. I don't care if you hurt their feelings because they're going to mess your stuff up. They'll mess your home up or whatever they're working on. Excuse me, they're going to mess it up. And you're the one that's going to be stuck with the bill. And I can hear it just as clear as day. This person is saying, the person that referred them, well, I didn't tell you to take them. I told you to just see if they were somebody you could use, but that's not true. Okay. So let's see if anything else. Yeah, and you're gonna you're gonna be upset. Somebody already knows this though. You've been having nightmares about this situation. Something about something going wrong. Please pay attention to it. It is your guys, your angels, your ancestors. Somebody is telling you, uh-uh, this ain't the route to go. Okay, the cheaper route is not always the best route. If you really need this done, and you're like, well, this is the only option. There's always other options. God is always giving us options. Trust me. Ask, pray, and wait for the guidance. Don't rush in. Ask for the guidance, okay? Bear with me here. This card just popped up in my face. Hold on one moment here. I had no intentions of picking that up. What is this? Somebody you're working with, are they a Jew? Or do they do some type of witchcraft that you know? I don't know who this is applying to. This is switching here. I don't know what this is about. Somebody may have, and I'm not trying to scare anybody, but I'm just trying to make you aware. If you're dipping around and playing in magic, please stop. Because it looks like you've invited something in or you're inviting something in. You're falling into some type of trap here. Somebody also could be trying to do some type of. Hold on one moment. Someone trying to trap someone. So make somebody fail or fall into something. No, no biggie. Simple prayer. Simple prayer. Give it up here. Give it to the Lord in prayer. Yes. Simple prayer. Get your vibration up. 
and you know, I would not, whoever this is, you know, this is not a shocker to anyone. This is not for everybody, whoever this resonates with. Please don't ever make a reading fit. If it's for you, it will just click, okay? So if this is you and you know this is clicking, then I would definitely just leave it to prayer. I would get away, stop dealing with these particular people or things that you are dabbling in or using because it's bringing something in or some, yeah, something's being brought in here, okay? All right, so I'm gonna end it there. I hope you found this helpful, Leo. Um, I will see you. Oh, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you just want to subscribe, subscribe, and I will see you next Friday. Bye-bye.